lights then from race three. It was Sebastian Ogard on pole position as we got the race underway. Christian Mansell with another one of his lightning starts, but got rather bogged down by Francesco Simonazzi. That opened the door for Alex Garcia to take second position in the early stages. Ugran in third from fifth on the grid, and those two would be fighting for the podium all race long. Christian Mansell and Oliver Goethe, they're both uh, running a little bit deep into Lecom. And that would slightly damage Freddie Lubin's front wing as well. It would also give Oliver Goethe a five second penalty that he would have to consider if he wanted to take that win. He set about carving through the order first, getting past Philip Ugran for second place. And it wouldn't be too long before he managed to get past Alex Garcia for the lead. Garcia would fight back. However, ultimately Goethe would start to gap him and the chasing pack to eventually claim the lead. And on the very final lap, after so much scrapping between them, Garcia and Ugran in a collision on the Kemmel Strait. And unfortunately, Alex Garcia not able to finish this race after that collision. But Oliver Goethe, for the third time, is due on the top step of the podium at Spa. The perfect weekend for the Great Dane and drama on the final lap as well as Ugran and Mansell got physical and that left the door open for Vladislav Lomko. Vladislav Lomko claiming third in the final moments there uh, of that race by just two thousandths of a second over Christian Mansell.